Hello, my juicy co-creators. Lilu here in Sri Lanka. We're heading towards the end of the day, but it's so delicious on the breeze. The, the heat has calmed down. Thank you for accepting to do this interview. Pleasure, pleasure. Tell us your name, your exact name. Um, my name is Kumar Rupasinghe. Uh-huh. Very nice meeting you. You have beautiful eyes, huh? <laughs> I didn't know that. Thank you. <laughs> I'm thrilled to to meet you because I'm all about you know seeing and witnessing change and 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 encouraging people to to be the change in the world that they want to see. And clearly, you brought you were few of you together, a group of people, and you decided to start implementing those changes um, on your own, if I could say, in different areas of society. Tell us about that initiative. First of all, you know, I'm I'm, I'm uh, very closely associated with Ubiquity University in San Francisco. And that is going to be a planetary university where it will have a presence in each country. Mm. And the vice chancellor is Ken Wilber. You may have heard of him. He's an extraordinary. Yes, I have. Yeah. Yes, he's a, and and all the people there, we work very closely. So that is one of the things we want to do is to introduce the spiritual dimension into into a global education system. So from there. We have here uh, a thing uh, called Wisdom Circle. It's, it's yes. people who are seekers uh, from different traditions. You know, people who are doing yoga, people who are in the Vedantic stream, people who are in the Buddhist stream. Uh, it's not any one dimension, denomination. So uh, as a result of this meeting regularly, we have also branched out to some things uh, where because of my passion for education i'm working with a group of people who are trying to transform the entire system of education from a factory system which it has been and rote learning and memorizing and tuition to free the child you know, to be a creative human being. Yeah. And it has got interesting success in one of our provinces, in the eastern province. The Minister of Education has been so impressed with the pilot study that now he has handed over, in fact, 100 schools for this transformational exercise. And once... How long did it took you to get to those 100 schools? Uh, about... Uh, altogether about three years. It's not much. Huh? We started with one school, and then five schools, then fifteen schools, and simultaneously working with the ministry to introduce a bill in parliament to transform the entire system as well. So it's it's like a pyramid. While we do the work here, we also work with the top to get their consciousness changed. Right, so that is one thing we are doing, and um, the, the second uh, is uh, indigenous medicine and healing systems, and this is basically to to is very much about uh, let us take cannabis. Now, cannabis we think is an ancient plant, and in our ancient traditions, cannabis was venerated as the most uh, healthy and most powerful plant, right? And uh, so we are now trying to get cannabis legalized, Mm. like in Ecuador, where it has happened, Mm. right? And uh, as a result of that, we are working on the treatment of cancer through cannabis, which has been a great success. We haven't started it yet, but we are going to try that, etc. So that is that particular movement, right? The third uh, movement, which we are uh, involved in, and they're all like in, uh, starting at the same time. Like yeah. people are, you're, you, you, you inspired people to to take it on and to run with it. And the people who have the passion yes. for that particular subject mm-hmm. is brought together, mm-hmm. because I think it is passion which drives yes. um, the momentum. You know. So uh, that also we are working on that. And thirdly, we are also trying to set up a, 
uh, healing center, but which can have all the traditions of healing, from pranic healing to Reiki to many other forms of healing, because we think and rejuvenation. Uh, you know, the government here in Sri Lanka is open to those different modalities of healing, or is it the same? How is it compared to Europe? Because in Europe and the United States, it's like no, 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 no. Even here, but we are making some. Uh, we are in touch and in dialogue. You know, because even the politicians need healing. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. At some point, they might be very happy to have those type of healing. Exactly, exactly, exactly. Right, and if it works, you know, then it works for everybody. So, uh, like that, we, we take on, uh, and then we have another one for organic farming, because we think that the entire agribusiness is poisoning the food and poisoning our body, right? And therefore, uh, we want to restore our ancient forms of organic farming without pesticides, weedicides, fungicides, you name it, right? And we have 9,000 members who are now involved in organic farming. And their vision is to form a cooperative, which will make it 100,000, and who will also develop organic fertilizers, right? And also farming systems, which will only rely on the energy. Do you, do you also go into the whole seed banks? Because I know in Norway they have created that, but we don't know who started it or if it's the government or what the story is really behind. Because I went all the way up to Norway to check it out, but that's another story because I didn't get the real answers. But are you are you are you are you trying to keep some of the fresh seeds? You know, from the, the different than the Monsanto seeds. No, what is happening is Monsanto has a big stranglehold in this country, like everywhere it seems. Right and. Uh, they are just going to introduce a bill to forbid our farmers to keep their own seeds and to exchange their own seeds. No way. Right? So this will be a big, big issue in this country. And there's Organic Farmers Union, which we are forming, and other bodies which have been working. And we are trying to invite Nandana Shiva from India, who's the, who's the kind of... Uh, leader of uh, the, this, this particular area um, and she will be invited here and then like that we want to stop that bill. So you're on big, uh, big uh, fronts, huh? You're, uh, it's, those are main areas in society. Is there some more areas you're, you're working on? Or you have created movement, or this is it education, uh, food? As as it comes, you know. For example, if there are people who are, I was just uh, talking about this. Uh, people who want to set up a university for ancient wisdom, okay, and a group have got together, so we will link up with them, right? Another group may want to have all around the world. This is international conversation, right? This is not just about the Sri Lanka for you. No, no. So we feel that the uh, planet is so sick with what has happened that. Uh, there is a movement now which is planetary movement right which is linking up to transform this yes. that is what I feel yes. I feel that too that's why I came all the way here yes. thank you thank you thank you thank you big big kisses to all co-creators I guess there is a website and I'll share that on the website yes. on yes <laughs> big big kisses much love bye 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 <laughs>